your present you, your past you and your future you meet up. What are you talking about? My future self is probably be that he doesn't get his own future self. But instead is having to visit with two past selves. Well he already got to meet his future self twice. What the hell would you have to complain about? Plot twist, you're the future you. No I am not going through this again. The only guy more irritating and stupid than my future self is my past self. Imagine what your future self has to go through. Yeesh. Imagine being annoyed by your future self as your past self. Then immediately getting annoyed by your past self as your future self. Most underrated post. Ways we F up. Regrets. How we can change. My future self definitely has been collecting lottery number results to give to his past self. Edit. Thanks for the upvotes. Smart. Sports bets for sure. Better hope the butterfly effect doesn't happen. Present me as telling past me that I need to stop eating so much food as it's really bad for my health. And the bullying at school over my weight isn't going to go away until I do something about it. But future me congratulates present me for the weight that I lost. And present me as excited because future me has reached her weight loss goal completely, hopefully. Future me says that present me needs to start exercising as well as managing diet. And that lockdown is not an excuse to stay inside all day. Present me agrees. But whether present me takes future me's advice, I just don't know yet. Old me a few years ago, so, we end up rich? Right, after we stick it to the man. And show all the people we know what we were capable of and start an empire? Present me, no. But the 9 to 5 thing is working out pretty good actually. Now it's all just about saving for retirement and trying to not stress out too much. My future me a few years from now holding a toddler standing next to my pregnant wife pfff. PPFFF. Ha 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 ha. So there is going to be this COVID thing. Future you. OS out of all the other stuff that happened I completely forgot about that global pandemic. Present you. Fuck. Talking about. Nah. Man. We F. I'm both narcissistic and insecure enough that I couldn't pass up the opportunity to see what I'm. Like in the sack. Plus I'm relatively sure all three versions of me would be down with it. I also want to see if future me has learned any new tricks. And set past me right on a few things. How often do you get the opportunity to have a three-way. Across time. Small talk just isn't going to cut it. You still procrastinating. Yep. You still procrastinating. Quote dot dot dot. I'll tell you later. Let me get back to you on that. I'm sure it'd be a fight. Why? Ourselves. Answers both what are you talking about and what are you doing in one word. Lottery numbers. Present me will be Mog1 and I will record lottery numbers and results going forward and will tell the past me to do the same. Mog1 ages and becomes old Mog1. Future me has died and the meeting happens again. Past me Mog2 has reached the present time and has recorded numbers and results the same amount of time as me old Mog1. I pass the numbers and results to Mog2 increasing his wealth and he passes the number and results. To pass Mog3 increasing his wealth also. Rinse and repeat. Min. Max the process as we go. Rock paper size or I guess. That's unfair though cause your future you already knows what your present you and past you are gonna play. Present me and past me are making a list of reasons why future me isn't here. If future me wasn't there I would flip my s. Yes. There's a chance he just didn't show up because he thought it was stupid or whatever. But if he's dead? So many implications. No talking just f. As long as past me is of legal age. But what if future you is 87? Weed. Definitely weed. I wonder if future MES smoking habits would have changed. I used to smoke primarily joints. Now I smoke out of my bong. 
Does future me use a pipe now? Also do I have a beard? Probably how much my life has changed and more importantly how much I have changed. I can look to see how I was once a blissfully ignorant child to an anxious lazy nervous wreck of now and to a hopefully mature and more confident adult. I think if my old self showed up and looked happy I wouldn't want to know the future. I wouldn't tell my past self to change anything either. The highs and lows are what make life life and to deny myself those parts. To make everything easy would fundamentally change who I am right now. I like myself. I like my life. It isn't always easy but it's what I got. Past. Hey remember that cute guy in high school? Present. Yes. I'm dating him now in college. Quote. Both past and present glare at future. Future. We have corgis. Weapons technology. Short stories writing. Memories from the lab. Future me will most likely be copying a large number of academic papers for present me and past me. To read. Past me isn't gonna survive this. I don't care that he is a child. He f up my life. I probably won't be surviving either. But I'm killing that f kid. Then that dumbass future me for not killing me sonner. Killings your past self would instantaneously kill both you and future you.